hey what's up everyone welcome to my channel and today's video we will do a iphone 7 review on ios 14.3 gold master so the gold master is almost the same as the public version but i will do be doing a public version review really soon so you uh, because it will be out really soon so you can subscribe to my channel and turn on notifications so let's jump in today's video so talking about bugs the first thing that i'm suffering with on this device is bugs for example here you can see i have not applied clear spaces or anything this is just a bug if i'll do like this yeah yeah here you can see there was a widget and uh, uh, I'm, I, I'm seriously really confused why is these bugs are happening on iPhone 7 especially uh, in terms of widgets and scrolling through my app library here uh, many people were getting some issues and uh, stutters but for some reason I'm not getting that I think it's a good thing uh, but uh, almost 90% of my audience is just sending me messages on my Twitter you can follow me on my Twitter by the way here is my Twitter handle you can follow me on Twitter and uh, many people on Twitter were messaging me that I am getting some stutters in app library I'm getting a lot of bugs and yeah I seriously don't know why iPhone 7 is suffering with a lot of bugs and I didn't expect it the same issues to occur on the gold master because as I said gold master is almost the same as the public version so I am seriously really confused but maybe the public version will solve this issue we seriously don't know at this point of time but uh, yeah let's let's see now first of all jumping into settings then if i'll go in general and then here you can see here is ios 14.3 and here is the build number the build number is 18 c65 and this is a build number of ios 14.3 gold master uh, it is actually rc but it is also called gold master so uh yeah I've cleared that and uh, talking about performance the performance is being like uh, almost the same as the beta 3 if you haven't watched that video you can watch that here is the i card you can watch that video and uh, talking about the issues I'm suffering as I just said there is some widget bugs and uh, if you want uh, and the, first of all the lock screen bug many people were suffering with this bug but finally this bug is fixed in the beta 3 but uh, many people were getting this bug then also so in this video I'm clarifying that that it, the bug does not exist now here you can see uh, I'm not getting any lag while opening and closing and the animation is also really smooth now yeah really it's like once in 20 times that I get lag whereas earlier it was like 9 out of 10 so uh, now the issue is uh, technically fixed but uh, some people are still having that so uh, I have cleared that that it is just a normal issue don't worry it will be fixed really soon Apple is working on that because I've talked to Apple support app and if you have any queries you can talk to me or on the Apple support app by downloading the app through the app store now let's talk about the battery life if I'll 3d touch here and go into battery first of all here you can see I have 100% I mean 100 percentage of my battery health so I I am the one of the guys who whose phone is at 100 uh, percent of battery health but then also here you can see the dips there the battery life is actually not at all good the last time I charged was 39 minutes ago 43 percent and it's 31 uh, percent right now and I didn't use my phone much I used it for like 10-15 minutes it was like one minute per percentage so I'm seriously really confused why this is the battery life is getting worse uh, as I'm updating my devices uh, on I use 14 it was like five Five hours then on I use 14.1 it uh, dropped to four hours then right now it is like two or three hours which is just really mad and considering I have 100% of my battery health then I'm getting not in four hours of usage who seven have battery health at 80 or 70 those people are getting like less than an hour of usage so uh, Apple I really want you to fix this issue I don't know if Apple anyone from Apple is watching this video or not but yeah I have talked to Apple support I have sent them mails about this issues but uh, yeah 
it is the, the thing right now iphone 7 users i know you guys are really irritated with your device and uh, don't worry i'm talking to apple support and uh, if you also want to talk to apple support you can download the app and they respond to everyone so thanks for watching this video i will be getting back to you guys because i know iphone 7 users are really pissed off so peace out i'll meet you all in the very next episode